Citizens Bank Park, Bedlam is back. Championship Series is presented by Lou. Hi, everybody. I'm Brian Anderson, along with Jeff Rancourt and Ron Darling. Will he mode? The Phillies are not. They're the ones in control. See, embrace that chaos tonight. First one will be Corbin Carroll. Eight pitches has not attempted to steal. He needs to do that after it's the thunder of the Phillies. 30 and 100 this year. Tori Lovello standing by with Matt Weiner. Matt? All right. I think a combination of both things. Look, it's, um, let's see where that takes us through the course of the night. I want us to enjoy it. It's a great moment. Yes, here in Philadelphia, exactly where manager Rob Thompson wants to make that number 6 and 0. Well, we got a pitch. Well, we got one of them in the sixth inning. We just got to put a complete game in. Three six and a big game pitcher in this postseason run and a guy who was always have won all of his starts. So has Nola. He is pitching his best. L fam finds his way back in the lineup. Alec Thomas, who's home. Diamond backs. Frenchie, how about the Phillies defensively? Well, no secret. Rob Thompson going. He plays this series in center field. And Nick Castellanos. Malensky is in left field and Lance Barksdale, who was excellentness. And the last two years, this has been one rise in games one and two. All the pieces a from back to back World Series. Yeah. And that one misses up at 18 in this series, which makes on your marker for the Arizona Diamondbacks. They're going to pitching staff has been just as dominant as their offense is. That's how games a left-hander zip comes back over the plate. And the umpire that have been racking up hits in this <laughs> else do the same. They're in good shape. Want to walk off in game three. Marte slices one down the left field line and foul. And no home runs, two runs, 135. I feel like he's got to be perfect. And make this crowd a little nervous. Yeah. Oh, well. Back-to-back K's for Aaron. This knuckle curve. Well, that knuckle curve is like three or four different pitches. He throws Corbin Carroll just to get me over. Kind of oh, talented young catcher. First <laughs> one's in there. The comeback sinks. He is five for 18. Yeah. Now you think about this season. Moreno fouls it away. Another one, two. Hold up. And he's got a little bit of that star quality taking pitches like that. Taking some time because he's trying to figure out what's his recourse. Here he comes. Spoils another one. He'll counts. Getting deep into counts, battling at the plate, out of their aggressiveness. That with a two-out single, just reaches down and big swing and a miss. Walker, the 17 right now, has eight strikeouts. He did a masterful job controlling him. And with that high fastball, that's been the for guys like Nola Wheeler, the great break and stuff. You're stuck out. And down he goes. This in LCS be his third start of the postseason. He has been heavy game seven. You know what's interesting? If you ask the Philadelphia Phillies hitters, he only allowed all three were home runs. First pitch, Schwarber takes a ball inside of this NLCS. Five total. He was a beast in the NLCS left home. <laughs> oh, and it's three and zero. Oh. No fire. And he walks on four consecutive pitches. And a lead man on here for Trey Turner. Harper will follow. Three Nick Castellanos, Brandon Marsh, and Johan Ro Kelly to Turner. And there's strike one. It was a pitch up and in. in the and that one's in the outfield. Feeling for the wall. He's got it. Schwarber tests the outfield. Lord Escuriel Jr. left. Alec Thomas, four home run. Three gazelles in the Diamondbacks outfield. runs this postseason. Two of those for Harper coming in this. Harper just changed. They took advantage with the running game in the first inning in air. Yeah, it, the 507 in game three, we talked about. And when I mean the shadow, it was the center field where the yep. lit up. Off and Harper's Brent Strom has not had a great series. Now listen. You don't want to walk two hitters. You know, Brian, the whole key here is that with the cutter of Merrill, he can. And Harper, Boehm looking to do some damage, and he's on them. 
And that'll end up in the seats. The 0-1. I'll tell you oh. this, you go back to the first pitch to decided not to challenge Schwarber and Harper. You got to get a get a bone and a swing and a miss. There's that slide. Here's a one two and Ooh. right there a called strike Philly. It's a backwards K. Well, what a great setup. You go over. all of a sudden he has precise uh, control. Exactly. Right? <laughs> Bryson Stott with two away. Kelly misses upstairs in game five as Ooh. Kelly puts one right down the heart. And a big swing and a miss from here at the plate. Did Stodd look like he was trying to shoot one? Phillies then knock two. Count evens at two balls, two strikes. So you got to believe I can foul off the sinkers all day long until I get Phillies. And Stodd get is calling. The shortstop makes the catch. And Merrill Cardinola back on the mound. Sun setting. Russ on Fox. Well in. Aaron Nola back to work. Struck out Walker to win the inning and a swing and a foul by Pham for game six tonight. Woo. Nola burns one off. Eight to ten. Well up. Goes back out there with a fastball. And Pham. And that one's going to fly. Tommy Pham. Silencer here in this second inning. Hey. Just kind of spins. Doesn't have that bite in you like you said. Important part of that home run is how quiet he got in here. Back to that oh, ball's hit. on his way back there. And Guriel goes deep. Guriel with his second home run of this postseason. Guriel had some big league at bats in game four and five. Was hitting the ball hard up the middle. Got the best hair going in the postseason. To get that sinker coming in. And left it out over the plate. And he pitched well, but the games he didn't pitch well, the home run ball. Mullen! Well, moments of this series. And now Thomas draws the walk. Patience from the Diamondbacks, and that's something hitting coaches on both sides. What happens, and obviously it's paid off. Kevin Long on the other side said the same. You are so pumped, and the adrenaline rush that air has been let out of the balloon, and sometimes you got to fight that. Me. That you can try to get yourself in scoring position. Ola. And that ball's ripped. And to the wall. Thomas racing around the bags. He'll be for Evan Longoria. Wade, the veteran hitter like this, was ready. And he got a first pitch fastball. And a ball no, you're yeah. right. And that uh, Philadelphia team has so much thunk. Against Aaron Nola. Three runs. Shows Bond again. Whoa, nope. look out. Nola almost clipped. Build that lead if you got opportunity. Nope. Takes another one. Two and one the count. Guys that has swung the bat well. Homered off. Shows again. And pops it foul. Right off the end of the bat. Count stays at four hitters. But Rob Thompson. Perdomo. Longoria is going to tag. And he'll. So the goal for Perdomo was to move him to. Th what would you say if you're on the bench? Boy, he's got no hit stuff exactly. tonight. Exactly. <laughs> Different story in the second inning as Carroll takes a ball. And watch this Wheeler the other day. Fastball out over the. Take it all the way. Two and one. Look at the defense in the infield. It's in. Let's count. Three and two now. In your direction. As hitters, you start to relax a little. Carroll, Nola deals, and a broken bat foul. Started the scoring. Guriel followed. They went back 3 2. Broken to Harper, race to the bag. Harper beats him. Guys, we talk about what was it? Fastball in. Went right. Hip check of Carroll. But two balls away, and then Nola. I'm in his life. Hello. Could tell Marte. Marte. Marsh has a beat on it. And the inning is over. Ariel follows. Then Longoria, 38 years of age. He navigated the first, worked around Schwarber and Harper, and then the. Now, JT's got the ability. Real Muto hits. And can't get there. That'll go to the wall. Real, Real Muto stays hot. 106. Thomas Dingus goes, keeps going away from him. Have a sack fly. A couple walks in there, but for the most part, he's had a lot of offers. 0 oh, 2 the count. Yeah, the, watch how the Diamondbacks. Have... 
And a called strike three. And on the corner and on the bottom of the strike zone. The one the ball was a Brandon Marty. Real Muto will be waved home. Scores Marsh to second. Look at this. It turns on it beautifully. It's totally gone. With a 3 0. Wide into that base, and his helmet came off to the dugout before I think he even hit. 2 0. Last two gets 23. Rojas fouls it right back. He is fired up. Real Muto Rojas. You know, you think about this out. Rojas oh, yeah, just got a piece of that. He found then it moves Brandon Marsh into left field as well. So now you get played. Bouncing. Got to hurry it. No problem to get Rojas and Marsh on the bag. And you might have an easy, not an easy double play because Rojas goes after Schwarber here. Walked him. You have to be careful with Schwarber because he has. In there. Come back. He's, he's trying to throw that comebacker at 92 93 paint. One, two and two, and Schwarber looks at ball three. Outs. Pitch had bad regardless. You see the sequencing for Schwarber, and that one misses low. It is ball four. He went with a chain. Latino MLB players join him. They break down games. Talked about that changeup, Ronnie, and not being able to hit it yet. Back to back, seven pitch plate appearances. And Turner does swing at the first pitch. Kelly, as he goes later in the count, you will see him work that ball that way. That five hits. It's five for four in game five. Punches that one foul out of play. And on the bat in the first inning. The dangerous the second. And a swing and a miss. And Kelly. Or JT Real Muto with a leadoff double. Marsh brings him in. Joe Mather, Diamondbacks hitting coach, sees his offense, puts some answer with a run in the bottom of the second. Oh. And the first pitch to Moreno for the Diamondbacks. Oh. You know, you can watch him at the play. 2-0 to Moreno. Let's it in the center. And Johan Rojas puts it over. And Jeff Bannister was hitting third for the NLCS team as well. For this young player. I think the catching position. All velocity. Down a few ticks from that first inning. He was two and one. Walker still can't get to the fastball. Well, it's a young player. There's got to be plenty of hits in there. That's you walk. <laughs> Sometimes shortstop, prospect shortstop. Remember, one, two two. Tried to hit the outside corner. Three two. Oh, and he lost him. One of the best. Five forty five slug on it this year. Looking for the ground ball here, and he gets it to second out there. Throw to first is in time to win that game 4 3. That was one year ago, CS a year ago. And the Phillies believe they are best year of the Phillies, and then rode it all the way to the World Series last season. Harper takes a called strike three out of his repertoire of pitches. Great moments. In postseason history, Joe Please. Ronnie had a big moment, Frenchie, on this. <laughs> Kelly fires. Nice pick by Moreno. Je Boom. Je just muscles one through. Yeah. Hey, Taco Bell rewards member. Saw him less a few times this week. <laughs> <laughs> on the first pitch, slow roller out to second. Marte shuttles. And the second out at second base. You know, you save some stuff sometimes, right? But this is one of sixth in this batting order. And the first pitch is in there. Got a call. And he's been effective so far. See Lavello just. The play by Nola was huge. Mm -hmm. They need to get him through a couple. He had a one out walk, got out of it. Oh. Runner takes off, Stott throw to second. And the tag is 19. They've been the aggressive one. And why it's so important like this now. Kelly has 2 2. Real Muto pulls it foul, went back to the chain. Two of the best catchers in baseball, one that's done it for a long time. Two and two. He got him to chase one. Kelly up. Is Guriel the second of a back to back? The Guriel brothers both in the league, right? It's the third time this postseason that the Diamondback. Game three of the DS. Guriel will make the call. And there's out number one. Up on him and just spun. But it was kind of so slow that he got. 
Thomas with nine home. A strike in there. One and two. Seems to be back. Three up, three down inning for Nola. Eight o'clock Eastern first pitch. Count victim his last time up. And a wave at a miss. Kelly ahead of him. O'Day. Phillies know they will have a to advance or to stay nope. alive. Trouble. Test Marte backs up on it, plays it on a hop, and makes a play for the inning. Tori Lovello said he might. The RBI single is last. What? I'm watching Kelly right now. Both pitchers actually are all. Three. And a called strike three. Marsh, but about looking. All on fastballs, all paint. Kelly is from Scottsdale. That ball's held. And running it down is Alec to the fourth inning. Still 3-1 Arizona. Phillies trying to punch Eesh. their ticket to the World Series. Nola giving up back. Let me tell you, Ryan Howard, one of my all-time. 0-2 pitch. In the fly ball. And Rojas converges on it to put. Back to the top of the order. Yep. All in two strikes. Matt Strom, who finished the one two. Right off the count, stays at a ball and two strikes. Got a lot of arms he can call on the rest of the way at this point. Merrill. Nope. Two and two. I used to both Nola and Merrill Kelly right now and say, I think these get two. Right in on his hands. He's in the game. Carroll is just chewing through the whole bat bag here for <laughs> Corbin. Big win last night on Sunday Night Football. Yeah, they look good. 2-2 pitch. And finally got one out over the plate. And he delivers during the year. At some point, you feel like you got to push the envelope a little. The slide step. The Phillies believe from all of their. They get a mistake from Nola. And Marks. Carroll can fly. He'll score easily. Put myself in. <laughs> He's two for two now. And Rob Thompson's got 15 consecutive games in the postseason. He has it. And run is the free official MLB skills competition for baseball. Well, pitching change here. Nola has a runner at third base. His responsibility. He's pitched a no-hitter and now deep in the field end. Moreno, a swing and a miss. <laughs> Boy, Arizona has come. All Turner looks the runner back, and there's out number two. That's really good breaking balls to one of the better hitters. Yeah, first time for one with a walk. First pitch in the dirt. Look at Real Muto straight down. Two and zero oh the count. <laughs> two and one. Walker waves and misses. At that point to come in. Got both ready to come into the game. Didn't. It's one thing too if you're Lorenzen here, you don't have to give. And Walker lays off. Lorenzen went up the scoring here tonight for Arizona. That was a leadoff home. <laughs> Lorenzen. And he fouls it away. And now it's one. It's in sliders. And Walker. Bam! A swing and a miss. Lorenzen continues his hitting ways. An RBI triple. Terry. Game seven tomorrow night will be Ice Harper. Schwarber takes a ball. And here he's got the win there and then started the game in 2019. Schwarber takes a strike. Bye. And you say to yourself, okay, I can quit throwing. That was the perfect. Two and two. Ball out. Schwarber a swing at him as Kelly's weapons. I mean, he's thrown two curb. And now Turner a swing and a miss. Kelly. Thus far, Dean for Thomas and Trey Turner is 0 for Harper's hits in this postseason. Well, and with a walk, big swing at him is change up. Ball out. Kelly doesn't really beat you on his chain wing, and it's one and two, two and two. And he struck him out. Harp out for Kelly. He is through five. Diamondbacks lead it four to five strong innings. One run was taken out. And he gets the ball here in this seventh Whoosh. inning. Deal strike one. Up the at bat with a fastball. Perdomo, the switch hitter, slaps one to left. Back in the seventh. You know what's impressive about Perdomo, guys, is for a young player. Oh. 
run. Good swing there. 79 strikeouts for Kirkering. Bullet! To the point where the Phillies were roster, that's why he hardly pit. Left field slicing. Oh. Marsh can't quite run it. That's at that. Oh. Yes, kind of. And I think that's one thing. There goes Perdomo. And yeah. a swing and a miss. That'll be a. I believe that's only a second steal for the Diamondbacks. Lord is great. Here is Marte. Whoosh. He's had very few. Saw, saw base covers. Marte Whoosh. takes a strike. 98 miles. In the Arizona portion. Well, that's a tell Marte's going to bring in Perdomo. And the Diamond Bay delivers again. RB. Diamondbacks most consistent hitter in this series and in this post a little usage and then he's great at after that fly ball to right Thank you Matt and Castellano never panic got a sweeper lined it up the middle for the Another stolen base that is their third cost that they had all season long well and right there JT never position for Christian Walker Oh Had the comeback in game Whoosh. four the Phillies look like them the Phillies in this one so far tonight in the air, it's on the run. He's got it. And the inning is game in the postseason. He's got 25 hits. Us here, the Thunder's coming. And a wave at a bit. That made up his mind. And now it's 0-2. Gibson, just tell Thompson, recognize the hitter. 0-2 pitch. Yeah, see if he'll chase another one. And Thomas will make the play. So Rojas is out. Got a run of right-handers. Come. Lefty. Andrew Saul Frank, EP of this NLCS. He's hit five home runs. Frank only appeared in 10 games in the regular season. A dissertation by studying for a half hour. I mean, most of his season Whoosh. in double A AA and triple A. And he so that's the big thing. You got a 5 1 lead. And he's spinning ball to second. Marte goes to second out there. Balls and Schwarber reaches on the field. On the edge. Follow Tall Frank deals. Schwarber's on the run, throw the second, and Schwarber is out. Incredible athleticism. Challenged. So they will challenge. Replays there as we check that. Step down and throw that on the run. Yeah, look, I don't play. Deal is confirmed. The runner is out. Philadelphia has one challenge. And it is five to one, and Craig Kimbrell enters the Craig Kimbrell to enter this game. You know, you saw his numbers. Like most closers. Kimbrell. This is with a fastball. A curveball from Kimbrell that has gotten him. Tommy Fan. Rojas lays out one. Right here is the jump. Look at the I level with it makes a beautiful person for that catch right there. Craig Kimbrell. Correa with a seat. One and two now of Thompson and Saul Frank to the eighth. Eww. And a called strike three. Kimbrell breaking news every day, all day on the MLB at season. A perfect six and zero oh by Brandon Marsh in the second inning. The biggest. Two and that was the thing too. Now game five, but they were Who takes a strike. Mullo. And it's ball four. Kimbrel. Kimbrel is a prime candidate to run on as one of those guys that kind of likes it. I think. <laughs> I'm, I have a feeling. <laughs> Another check on him. Busted through the pipe. right there. He knows how to. He doesn't take want care of his equipment. And he Longoria takes a strike. Thomas goes. Longoria oh. lets him run. Throw the second. Short hops in. It's the fourth steal of the game for the day. You can allow yourself to make sure he's going to home. And act. Longoria takes a ball. A little bit early. Saw him do for two and two. Pressure pitch for Craig Kimbrell. Kimbrell deals three and two. When the runner was thrown out. Swing at him as Kimbrell. Gets the stripper and Boehm coming up. Game is he in his same spot?
in the bullpen. He goes, one, two pitch. Ball! Oh! Just missed. I would have. Harp and Thomas right to the spot. Two up and two. Just off the end of the bat. Most of the night, the Diamondbacks have been able to keep this now. Mm. Baum, a swing and a miss. The 0-2 to Baum. Doesn't bite on the slider. There's some early runs. Settle Merrick Kelly down. Baum threw a base hit. A little pepper swing by Alec. Hits the other side of the field, and what that does is that frees you up a little bit. Hitting. Philly's desperate for some. The 0-1 and a hot. And Carroll will make the catch.